Hey, time now for a look at that upnorthlive.com forecast. Thanks for tuning in. We had some rain uh, passing through the area on our Tuesday, or rather Monday night, early hours of our Tuesday along a cold front. That moving eastward, and in the wake of that now, some sunshine, and that has been a rarity as of late. But we will see the quietest stretch of weather this week today on our Tuesday, Tuesday night, and a majority of Wednesday before it gets much more active. Once again, there's a storm out in the Central Plains. Uh, working into the plains and that will get here late this week. So sunshine Tuesday, a little bit of cloud cover, maybe some patchy fog Tuesday night, early Wednesday. And you can see we start the day Wednesday with some sun, but it will cloud over and not far behind will be some rain that will impact downstate areas first. And then here comes the rain into northern Michigan. Late Wednesday into Thursday, we could see some thunderstorms. This is heavy rain right here. The other concern, and I'm going to show you another map of this in a moment, is the threat for freezing rain potential over the eastern UP. So that is a, a concern, and that would be late Wednesday night, early Thursday. You can see that ongoing right there. There's the heavy rain that passes through. Again, some thunderstorms, certainly a possibility. It looks like we get a little bit of a break Thursday, and then Thursday night and Friday, another round of rain will sweep into northern Michigan. We mentioned the ice potential. While we see heavy rain in the forecast for northern lower Michigan, there's where we're looking at some icing from Ontario back over the UP into northern Wisconsin. If by chance you do have travels in this direction, and again, that would be Wednesday night through the day, Thursday. But in the short term, here's our Tuesday forecast. Again, not a bad day. Highs in the mid and upper 40s. Winds out of the west, they will gust to 20 to 25 miles per hour at times. And a quick note, there is free severe spotter training Tuesday night in Gaylord. That will be at 630 at the University Center at 80 Livingston Boulevard. The National Weather Service will be on hand. The class is about two hours. Again, the training is free. And there's the Storm Team seven day forecast. Again, there's the freezing rain in the UP Wednesday night through Thursday. Thursday and Friday, the rest of the area looking at rain and thunderstorms. And keep in mind, the rivers are already high. So as we add in this rain, we could see some flooding potential in some of the area. Rivers will keep you updated on that.